Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Uh, we're gonna be doing something interesting today. I'm just kind of like, whatever, it's Sunday, it's super hot outside, and we're gonna cut Chris's hair in the garage. So, just for reference, I am not a hair stylist, hairdresser. I've never cut hair before. This is a brand new thing for me. Chris has been asking me to cut his hair for forever. So even before, you know, we couldn't go to hair salons and all that kind of stuff. Like now, you know, places are starting to open back up. Uh, but he's asked me a couple of years ago to cut his hair for him. And he's like, I'll just buy a buzzer and, you know, all that kind of stuff. Um, we never did it. I didn't want to. I was like, I don't want to be at fault for what may happen or how you may look until your hair grows out or whatever. But um, yeah, he hasn't cut his hair since sometime in February. I think it was like middle of February or something like that. So it's today is july 12th so he hasn't cut his hair for about five months so that's what we're going to be doing today we ordered a like hair buzzer like trimmer thing from amazon and it took like uh, over a month i think it was like two months or something for it to get here um we'd been planning to make this video and today it's finally happening so we're setting up in the garage so it's a little bit easier to clean and that kind of stuff we don't want to you know make the house a huge mess or anything so that's what we're doing right now it's pretty hot outside so we have the ac going on in here and i just thought i'd film an intro before i get outside and we start doing all that crazy stuff so i will see you guys back in just this a is what we're working with today um don't know how to use it we'll probably need to look at the instructions before we get started but yeah i have no idea like what these do or anything i mean i have an idea of what they do but I don't know which one I'm supposed to use, so we're just, I think I'm just going to start off with like the one that looks like it will cut the least amount um, initially, and we can work our way down from there. Oh, look, at least there's like measurements on here. I didn't notice that earlier, but I'm thinking that'll be helpful. All right, you guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Um, I totally forgot to film like an ending to the video after I actually cut his hair, but it was easier than I thought it was gonna be. It did kind of scare me because his hair was actually so long by the time I got around to cutting it. Um, so when I ran the buzzer through and I saw all that hair come off, it kind of freaked me out a little bit. And I was like, what is this gonna look like afterwards? I'm also totally not used to like switching out the different guards and I don't know like how long it was like or how much it was gonna cut how short it was gonna end up being so i just kept it on like one and then i think i switched out somewhere along the way but then it looked to me like i was gonna start messing something up and making things all uneven so scratch that i called it a day and stopped cutting his hair but yeah overall it was a lot easier than i thought it was gonna be um it was a lot messier than i expected as well especially when you have like those really really tiny 
um, pieces of hair. That's when it got pretty messy. The hardest parts were actually around the ear. I had a hard time with that. I felt bad for like folding his ear down and he was like, don't worry about it. This happens to me all the time. Anytime I go and get a haircut, um, I think we will try to do it again. Um, his hair has grown out a little bit since I cut it. It's been maybe like three weeks, three or four weeks now, I think. Um, so since I cut everything one length, the back has definitely grown out. The top looks like almost the normal-ish length if you were to go in and get a haircut. So I'm thinking about like coming back down this way and you know making it look like there's a hairstyle going on. <laughs> But we'll give that a try. Um, I'll let you guys know how it goes in the future if you're interested. Um, if you are not already subscribed to my channel, please click that subscribe button down below. And if you enjoyed watching this video, give it a thumbs up. Comment down below if you have cut hair before or if right around now is the first time you've ever cut someone's hair as well. Or maybe you've tried to cut your own hair. I honestly would be too scared for that. I've actually never dyed my hair myself either. I always go into a salon and have someone do it for me. But yeah, I'd be interested to hear your stories or if you have any suggestions on how I can better cut Chris's hair, those are welcome. I will also leave my Instagram down below if you, in case you want to follow me there. I may be doing the updated um, haircut shots on Instagram stories instead. Um, that might be a little bit easier since it'll be really quick. But yeah, thanks again for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.